Good morning. I just woke up and I am just sipping on some coffee. I have to start my day with a nice cup of coffee. Um, we uh, have a Chemex, so it's kind of like a more involved process every day, but it is kind of a nice way to wake up. Um, so all of the coffee that we use is from our friend who is a local roaster and he sources all of his coffee from like single farm origin and farming communities so that's been really cool because he's able to really like foster good relationships with the growers and be able to like give the farmers the most money for their product um and it's really good coffee so i'm definitely spoiled <laughs> um and then we're gonna go to the farmer's market so i usually try to eat breakfast before we go so i don't start off hangry um and then come back I have a spin class, I have a dress fitting that I need to go to for my wedding dress, and then my, uh, so my mom's gonna come with me for that, uh, and then we're all going to a baseball game later tonight, so it's gonna be a busy but a uh, really fun day. So I just got back from the farmer's market and I want to show you everything I got. Um, I got these really cool, I think they're called chestnut mushrooms, and they look like this. Um, they're really yummy. I like kind of getting just different mushrooms so I can kind of change, you know, shake things up a little bit. Uh, so I got those. I got some kale. I really love this vendor. Uh, at the farmer's market because all of their stuff is like pretty reasonably priced and it's organic and I always like to support local when you can, you know? Um, I got some onions and I figured these might be nice like for salad and then the tops, you know, scallions for things. So we got those. And then I got some bok choy, which I really like. Um, I really liked using this with like a little bit of uh, uh, rice wine vinegar um, and a little soy sauce and goes really well with a lot of things. Got a cucumber. Got some couple jalapenos. And then I got some of these delicious looking tomatoes. I love, I just love when my salads look super colorful. Um, just makes it like fun to, to eat. So, that's everything. And voila, delicious looking salad. Does anyone else always think of like whole, the movie Holes when they cut onions? Cause if I ever eat a raw onion, that's just the first thing that goes to my mind. I don't know. They have to be in the house. Hey, Hi, puppy. Hi. Hi. Hi, oh, sweet. Okay, so I just finished uh, with the seamstress and tried on my uh, short dress, which I'm using for uh, engagement photos and for rehearsal dinner. I'm gonna get as much use out of it as I can. Um, and my wedding dress wasn't ready to try on, but I'll be able to try that on next week. Uh, she's actually gonna bring it on vacation with her. <laughs> so my dress gets to go to Cape Cod and I do not. Uh, but I'm really hoping that she can finish the short dress by next week or at least by the week after because we're waiting to do schedule photos until we have that dress. Um, and I mean, the wedding dress I don't really need until the wedding. So that one has a little bit more extra time, but that one is apparently not as complicated because that fit one, that my wedding dress fit it. I got a sample. Um, so I tried on a dress from Hinterland Bride and I loved it. Um, and then they were doing a sample sale and that dress was part of it. So I ended up getting a, a Rue de Cien, Rue de uh, Cien. I don't 
know how to pronounce it, but um, which is like a four thousand plus dollar dress um, for half price basically, uh, which was super, super great. And if, like I said, it fit me almost perfectly. So there's a couple alterations I need to do, but nothing too drastic. And then I have a, another sample dress I got from them, um, which is a short, uh, uh, shorter dress and it's great. Uh, but that one's a size 10. I'm a size eight, um, in wedding dress sizes. Uh, street sizes are way different, by the way, if you haven't started looking for wedding dresses yet. Um, so I'm really hoping that she can get that one done early because I really would like to get some photos done before our actual wedding. Um, and uh, yeah, so we'll see what happens by next week. But now I'm gonna go home. I'm going to get ready for the baseball game and we're gonna have a good time. I can take it. <laughs> So then we left the game and we ran into uh, R2-D2 and Baby Yoda. My mom had never seen uh, any of that before, so that was kind of funny as she was trying to figure out uh, R2-D2 and who Baby Yoda is. And then we walked down the hill and went home. I never filmed an outro to this, so I'm doing a little voiceover thingy. Uh, thanks for watching. It was a really fun day and I will see you guys later. Bye!